every one of us should have a love relationship with our prophet. When we hear his name, okay, our, our skin should, I mean our, as we say, you know, the hair on our body should stand up. We should feel honored, the name Muhammad. It should be so ingrained in us that every movement we take, we're thinking, would my prophet be pleased if I did this? If I'm sitting in this circle and there is gossip taking place right now, would, would my prophet be pleased with this? Would he be in my circle? If he smiles at me, that's the greatest thing in life. If he frowns at me, I am very disappointed for he is my moral pathway. We should focus, brothers and sisters, upon ourselves. Here, I, am not, I did not come to praise the Messenger of Allah because he needs our praise. He doesn't need our praise. We need to praise him. Because when we praise him, we will have an affinity for his lifestyle. We will have an affinity for him. We will have a love for him. We will want to be like him. If we ignore him, then we will have an affinity for someone other than him. For at the end of the day, our affinity, okay, cannot be escaped. We cannot escape having affinity for somebody or something. It's impossible. We're always attracted to something. So we have to decide who is the greatest. Today you find that people tell you, don't celebrate his birthday. There are people, don't kiss his uh, sarcophagus, don't kiss his grave. They tell you this, don't kiss the grave. They want to disconnect us. Whereas Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is saying, the only way you will come to me is through the Messenger of Allah. That's why Allah says, لَقَدْ كَانَ لَكُمْ فِي رَسُولِ اللَّهِ أُسْوَةٌ حَسَنًا on what condition? Liman kana yarjullah. Notice, liman kana yarjullah. For those who want to return to Allah. That means my return to Allah is through the Messenger of Allah. Liman kana yarjullah. Wal yawm al akhir. And one who believes in the Day of Judgment. Wa dhakar Allah kathira. And the one who remembers Allah a lot. These are the kinds of people who see the Messenger as their guiding light.